Oh. Get into more Elder Scrolls. If I found, sound a little bit off, I am. I think I'm coming down or something. But hopefully, I'm just wrong and I'm just a little dehydrated because I haven't drunk much water today. And hopefully, I'm not. An actual house in this house. Oh, it's just a balcony.
God, why are there Imperials here? Which part of the these guys for? They are. I can something on my phone real quick. It's getting a bit heavy. You found the perfect spot for us. Yes. Sir Lannis and his knights volunteered to come with me. But I only see... Good. But listen. There's a... Traveling with me. And everything was...
Fancy meeting you here. Tavern, I said. Meet me in a tavern. There's no ale down here. Just zombies and tentacles. Dear Gabrielle's spell seems to have misfired. Luckily, a few of us were able to find each other. I also convinced the Bloodthorn cultist to tell me how to reach Angoff. I can be... Three locks protect Angoff's inner sanctum. I doubt that even you can get in there by simply knocking. I wish I could aid you, but I'm needed here. Lannis is good with a sword, but I'm better. I'll protect the survivors. Let's... I don't know exactly, but the blood... All I know is... Actually, I... it seems that when Angoff... Wizard Benelay said you'd gotten inside and were hunting Angoff. We met Wizard Benelay outside. She said you'd use a binding stone. My best guess? Deeper inside the catacombs. Vines are going from the zombies. Bloodthorn cultists, that's why they're called bloodthorns, because the vines. Guessing. Never creep up on a person. You're the mad fool who went into the catacombs ahead of us, aren't you? By the way, did the other knights make it? I'll head out as soon as I see a clear path. A word of warning, though. The lurcher in the chamber ahead is extremely tough.
Stay back. This area is trapped. Don't get caught like I did. I've been watching to see how it works. After each trap fires, mm. there's a brief moment when you can disarm it. During this moment, you have to defeat its guardian. It's the only way. So, I'm not the only one left? Spirit, his gaze, they're here? I'll tell him. You are the one who wishes to destroy my master. I know what you seek. The shard key is bound to my spirit, as surely as I am bound to guard it. What cannot be said directly may be hinted at. Listen then. Rot and death are Angoth's guise. Living flesh holds his demise. I must release the shard to the one who brings me what the living flesh beyond this crypt holds. I cannot say directly. Ah, uh, maybe. To dis yes, but take care what you say. The words must be repeated exactly as written. You come to destroy my master? I know what you seek. I would tell you a simple riddle, yet you already have the answer in your possession. That yes, but take care what you say. The words must be repeated exactly as written. No, fool! The stone! No! Uh. Voice from somewhere in fact, eternal darkness come forth. You come to destroy me? Yes. But take care what you say. Ah, oh, it's done. Thanks. We'll do what we can to help. Just stay away from his vines. So you are the vain fool who seeks to flag Lenumbra from my grasp. Ah! After I kill you, I shall raise you up and make you my slave. <laughs> Big looks dead already. Well, that was fun, wasn't it? 
All right, maybe fun isn't the right word, but you were glorious. Angoff is finally dead. He can't thank you enough for what you've done. The others have all collapsed in their tents. They're exhausted, but I wanted to welcome you back. And Sir Lannis wants... who knows? Maybe he wants... The King will be grateful for what we've done here. Some of Angoff's minions are still running loose, but it's nothing we can't handle. Without Angoff's magic, hopefully the vines will wither and die. If not, I'm sure the... Yes, but I can't put my finger on it. We've heard rumblings that things up north aren't looking any better. Not necessarily vines and such, but there are whispers of other things. I hear there's trouble in Coglin village. Something bad is happening up there. But don't worry about that right now. We just saved the people of... The king set aside this armor for the champion who defeated Angoff. It was a treasure of Daggerfall, and now it belongs to you. It's your reward for... Sir! Sir, I... They took him, sir. Is there anyone else? Uh, the captain. We were returning from Daggerfall when our caravan was attacked. Bretons fighting with Daedra at their side. Stormhaven. Ruins. Near the... Popping that down real quick. Oh, wait, hold on. I don't know why. much longer they will break us
us which have had enough. stuff right now Bunch of space.
remains of oblivion. Welcome. Quiet for an inn. Gods, they killed them all. Those Daedric filth killed my entire patrol. Then they dragged me. High King Emrit needs to know about this cult. With their nightmare magic, these Daedric madmen could plunge Stormhaven into chaos. As soon as I recover, I'm going to Wayrest. I don't know, but it's without a doubt. No more than most. With the Great Shackle destroyed, has the plane mill been stopped? Whoever you are, you've got to help me. I know the local constable is apparently two arrows shy of a quiver. The town was attacked by slavers, and he's accused me of being involved. I am a knight of the flint. Just that I arrived in town right before the attack. It's absurd. Nerves are on edge at the castle, so I was sent to help protect the village. A messenger should have arrived ahead of me, but Constable Pascal said... I'm glad you came along. The constable's down by the docks. If he won't listen to reason, try to find the messenger from Alcare Castle. He can explain everything. If you can get me released, the Knights of the Flame will be in your care. I can't imagine who would do such a thing. 
If that is the case, though, someone needs to send word to the Knights. The Knights of the Flame are sworn to defend Stormhaven from any who would do harm to the Bretons. But our primary duty is to protect the royal family. High King Emmerich, of course, and his brother. Indeed, all kinds of rumors, spies at court, an attempt on the Duchess's life, an army of Red Guards with orders to storm the castle. Welcome to Coglin Village, Traveler, but you'll have to excuse me. No time for idle chat. Exactly. Everyone is all worked up because she's claiming to be a Knight of the Flame. I give her credit for a brilliant disguise, but I wasn't born yet. Again, a very convenient lie. There was a messenger from the castle here, but he didn't say anything to me. He was over there by the warehouse when the slavers attacked. Those fancy clothes... Well, I got the town guard organized fast and had the slavers in full retreat. The cowards. They barricaded themselves in the warehouse, though. Be my guest. Just don't expect any help from the guard. The slavers are like rats. The Dunmer crept up from the south and attacked in the dark. They killed the watch guard, but not before he... It's possible, but we cornered most of the cowards and cut them down. The last... It's lucky we were able to... Try to get out of there. I dare you. It's about time. I assume the Duke sent you? I am his personal messenger. I had a message for the constable. Not that it's any business of yours. Sir Hughes of the Knights of the Flame sent me with clear orders. No, please, I'll tell you. Not like it's a really important secret or anything. Sir Hughes just takes himself. No, I never got the chance. I had to talk to my friend first. Well, I didn't have to, I suppose. Wine, what are you hiding for? You know what I'd love to do? I'd love to lay waste to every last one of these poxy clowns. This young man is lucky to be alive, though I'm not sure he realizes it. He told me about the message from the castle. The whole thing just seems... My duty is to ensure the safety of this village, and my gut's telling me that she's part of the threat. Too many coincidences. If we can get the... The slavers are on board. The captain claims he's not with them, but I know the truth. He's asking me to send the town guard to help him clear the slavers from below decks. It's clearly... He's not, but even if he was, it wouldn't be my problem. My duty is to the village, not his ship. Bottom line, he needs to turn. You do that. Soon as we can ensure the town's in no immediate danger. Dude's a fucking idiot. Look, do the washing now. Change is finished. Constable 
says, be ready. He's got a plan. In all my years sailing these seas, I've never received such ill treatment in a friendly port. My men lie here bleeding on deck and we are refused aid. I'd sooner eat sand than do business with these Dunmer swine. I have explained this. Last night was dark. When I realized there was no beacon to mark the shore, I dropped... It was a daring battle. The slavers outnumbered us ten to one. But we'd planned for this. Yes, of course. I would gladly give my ledger over, but unfortunately it is below decks. This is why I've asked the... You are brave. Perhaps even a little foolhardy. Captain still refuses to leave? All right, you have the ship's ledger. The captain said it was lost below decks. You'll have to study it. No, I'm sorry, we just can't take that risk. I dreamed about all of this, you see. The slavers. Yes, Savisa the blacksmith too. And I don't care how it sounds. Defending the village is the highest priority, and we need weapons for that. Actually, I prefer you didn't. I appreciated your objectivity at first, but I must admit I am beginning to question your intentions. I prefer if you... You don't know what you're talking about. Paranoid. If you saw what I saw. Idiot. Influence of a cultist. Constable Pascal sent you here with orders to open the forge. You can just turn around and head right back out the door. That man has no right to order me. Arrest me? That beef-witted bastard. To think I even cooked that man breakfast. What an oblivion's gotten into him. First he arrests a knight of the flame, and now me. We were friends for years, and then one night... Well, I guess you don't need the details. For a month or two, I thought we had something. Then he just broke it off. He did? He was having trouble sleeping. You know, I saw one of those weird cult members leaving his house. The superb... Good idea. Perhaps there's some indication of... That'll do it. <coughs> Let's 
expecting a hex bag, but that'll work. Both hex bags on this game. Turns out that almost everyone in town thinks Pascal's been acting strange, even the guards. Oh, my poor little Pascal, what a mess you've made. Indeed, as I said, even the town guards knew something was amiss. I told them to be ready, I suppose. Hello there. My aching neck. I haven't been this sore in years. Oh, but freedom sure does feel good. Great. Not as glad as I am, believe me. It seems I'll need to take over security here in the village. And with those slavers out there, I need to get busy. First, the villagers may not realize it, but you saved this town from crumbling into chaos. I mentioned before that I came from El Care Castle. The situation there is critical, and I think you might be able to. I could give you a list to be sure, but my concerns are more general. There are rumors of assassins and spies in the castle, and as a good question, we're all part of the Daggerfall Covenant, right? Maybe hmm. it was a false. Sounds like um the uh madness is brave. You should have listened to me. So now we have the constable. I didn't want to do it, but it had to be done. So you're all in league with her? I should have known. Not so fine, are you now? As soon as you start talking sense, we'll let you out of there, honey. My poor, poor Pascal. I... Finally, now they can get all the... This wouldn't happen in Rothgar. And if it did, we'd just string the madman up. Or your <laughs> friend. This is bad. This is all bad. What's happening to us? Dude's definitely lost a few screws. Stay on your toes, friend. Be on guard if you're headed up to the castle. King Faharajad's army is camped outside the walls. To attack the castle, isn't that obvious? This is the beginning of the end for the Covenant, mark my word. Of course, I wasn't born yesterday. Neither was Dame Follett. What? Cool. 
Interested in... Killed. Damned foreigners. Nothing but trouble around here ever since the Duke married King Faharajad's daughter. And now there's... Envoy a... Darima marches up with an army claiming she's on a diplomatic mission from King Faharajad of Alakir. She says her message is for Duke Nathaniel alone. My mission is clear. No one from the Red Guard camp allowed in the castle. I'm a Knight of the Flame and I will enforce that directive to... Pox! Dame Davien wanted me to tell the Duke you were coming here. You saved me back in Coglin. I'm sorry. I got back here and I had... I can't believe I forgot to announce you. Oh, yeah. I forgot to deliver the message to the constable in Coglin. I know. You're <laughs> right. I've never been a very good messenger. I always wanted to be a king or a duke or something more important. You're welcome to Alcair Castle. I'm sure you noticed King Faharajad's army camped outside our walls, so you can understand why Duke Nathaniel is not entertaining you. <laughs> Don't hear that too often, but it's most welcome. If blood gets spilled here, it could destroy the fragile alliance holding together the Daggerfall Covenant. We need to defuse the situation. Damn it. Dame Follett is holding the envoy up at the gate, isn't she? Never questioning orders is Follett's strength and her weakness. I'll have to send word to make an exception. Meantime, I actually have a task you do. It's a sensitive matter. We've intercepted secret messages to King Faharajad from someone inside the castle who goes by the alien. Unfortunately, the Duke requires that he personally approve all visitors to the library. And he can't know about this. The library guard, Sir Gregory, perhaps you... Again, you must keep this quiet. The Duke is already overwhelmed and hearing about a spy inside the castle might push him over the edge. Get past Sir Gregory, and for better or worse, the Duke defers to me on the matter for now. Nathaniel shares King Emmerich's bloodline, but not his talent for calm under pressure. Indeed, Duchess Lakana is one of King Faharajad's youngest daughters. They say he was quite fond of her. She doesn't speak of her father much, but I think those ties run deeper than she lets on. I cannot defy the Duke's order. Tell me you don't come bringing more bad tidings. I've already heard about the slavers on the shore and the cultists in the hills. I hope you will forgive us for not offering a more friendly welcome. The affairs of the region weigh heavily on my husband's shoulders. The Avon got a cultist problem. Hold it right there. This is Duke. If it's an emergency, you want the armory, not the library. It's just books in there. Honestly, I don't know. Hey, that's not very nice. My face is nice, though, isn't it? I don't like being threatened, though. All right, all right. Hang up away.
Sometimes a true knight must undertake a mission that requires reading books rather than slaying monsters. I fear this much. We have to proceed carefully now. We don't want to alert the Duchess or... I hate to say it, but I'm going to have to speak with the Duke about this. The fact that the Duchess is sending secret letters to her father is serious cause. After speaking with King Faharajad's envoy, Duchess Lakana asked to go out and negotiate with the Red Guard General herself. Clearly, we can't allow that. My thoughts exactly. And in so doing, you would win her confidence. You already helped get the envoy through the gate, so Lakana will be inclined to trust you. Go speak with her upstairs. Tarima told me you spoke to Sir Hughes about Dame Follett. Thank you. You don't know what a relief it is to have her here. I am an outsider in Alcair Castle, because there have been several attempts made on my life, all from someone within these walls. An Alakir poison intended for my lips killed one of my tasters just a few days. There are many rivals for the throne in Alakir. They despise the Covenant, and they would kill me to destroy it. My father has been trying to identify the assassins, because Darima is the only one in the castle I can fully trust. Can I trust you? You did intercede on our behalf with Sir Hugh. Thank you. Okay. I'll be back in a few minutes, so I'm gonna have to hang out the washing. I want to grab my phone.
back. It's weird, there's a glitch. Oh no, it's not. It's the bloody Twilight Matriarch. Okay. It's probably a little too high. You should walk with more respect. You are in a camp full of soldiers. As am I. Let us dance then. What have we here? You come very well. Let us dance then. Nothing. Let us dance then. Not bad. You think? Let us dance then. Fortune favor you, my friend. Make a selection to reveal your rewards. A crudely can see you are out of crates. You can may luck follow you. Ha, as am I. Let us dance then. Wouldn't have expected. Hmm. You don't look so dangerous. 
this? Get you waltz into my camp. The princess, she is all right then. That is good. King Faharajad sent me to protect her, but there is little I can do from out here. I do not wish to start a war, but I... Ah, yes, indeed. The poison maker was quite stubborn, but he spoke a name with his dying breath. It means nothing to me, though. She is. Then she is in the castle. Go then, quickly. Had so much to I wonder the chick had too much. Ah, I wonder the chick had so much distrust. An undead werewolf took over Camelot. Hold, undead... criminal! Stop! Werewolf? Criminal! How does that even yeah. handle it? Thank you. A lot. to see you returned what the knights of the flame are sworn to protect me why would one try to take my life i hope dame follett was acting alone in this if there is a wider no this will not do to run would be to surrender to this madwoman's hatred follett is the one who must pay though i don't always agree with him sir hughes is a good man and i trust him i can't believe my suspicions were so far from the truth the assassin being a Breton only makes this situation more volatile because it has greater potential for destroying the Daggerfall Covenant. My choice to go to my father for... Indeed. I trust you've earned the Duchess' confidence by now. But after the attempt on her life, that makes sense, but why go to her father? The Knights of the Flame are here to protect her. It makes no sense. Why would he send an army here? Dame Follett, are you... Are you certain? That's a grave accusation. Of course... I was hoping you might volunteer. That would help avoid a scene. Follett's home... What it's come down to. Been so cute. Where's Follett? Did she run? I'm sorry to hear that. You did what had to be done. I wish I could say there was no longer cause for concern. Somehow, though, I just don't. Indeed. I would very much like to discuss this with you further, but not inside the castle. My home is past the mark.
Hadi git. Hadi var. Soon, my channeling arcane power. Sir Hughes send you to kill me? You're not here to... Oh, merciful Stendar! Matan... No, she's not safe. Hughes is going to kill her. He's crazy. Something about his dream. the ancient by the gods they've murdered the duchess hey light what why would someone do this Be real. Alaka. Sir Hughes? Was he mad? He was supposed to protect her. How will I explain this to Lakana's father? To his sister? I don't understand. Sir Hughes served me for so many dreams. That maniac murdered my wife on the basis of a dream? He will die for this. You must help me find him. He's probably gone to Firebrand. King Baharajad will be devastated. That's cool. You're looking for Sir Hughes, aren't you? Get in line! We've been waiting for him to come and clarify our orders for days. He returned, all right. The Duchess is dead? Hughes killed her? Oh, for Mara's sake, I didn't think he was that crazy. 
I guess that explains why his orders were so con- So, I guess if Sir Hughes killed the Duchess then, crazy or not, the Duke is gonna want him to answer for them. He went into the keep. Sir Croy might be protecting him, though. Finding Hughes may be difficult until we clear up all the confusion here. Taking a stand for- If you've come to Firebrand Keep to petition for help from the Knights of the Flame, I'm afraid you'll be disappointed. This is far worse than I thought, and makes our cause all the more critical. Sir Hughes just returned to the Keep acting strangely. He's in there with Sir Croy, who is making preparations to attack the Red Guards at Alcare Castle. Indeed. Myself and these others were exiled for standing against Sir Croy. But we are too few at present to retake the keep. There are other knights in the keep. Other knights in the keep. If Sir Hughes really wants us to go to war, I'd prefer he told us. You're right. This doesn't make any sense. If all care is true, you're right. You're right. This is Did I get lucky? If Sir Hughes really you're right. I got real lucky. I knew more of my fellow knights would come to see the insanity Sir Croy means to unleash at Alcare Castle. Indeed. Taking up arms against our fellow I really want to talk to the rest of them. This is not a good time for the night. If Al <laughs> Indeed, I've told the night. We caught them by surprise, and I think we have the upper hand. I've been wounded, though. I've done what I could, but I failed to find Sir Croy. Now I fear he would best me quite easily. He's in the eastern garrison.
I mean, I got a flu shot on Monday, so I, but I doubt it's that. It's likely just a cold. Running yesterday, kind of didn't really dress warm enough. to rebellion. I'm going to enjoy this. It's probably a cultist. I grieve for Sir Croy and all those who died fighting for him. But there was no other way to save the Knights of the Flame. Thank you for doing what I could not. Indeed. With Sir Croy slain, I am assuming command of Firebrand Keep for now. Needless to say, preparations to march to Alkirk, killing my fellow Knights to restore order was hard enough. But this matter with Sir Hughes is unthinkable. He's down in the infirmary. Then I suppose you must. Whatever crimes he may be guilty of, you should know that Sir Hugh... The infirmary is below the Great Hall. Speak to the healer there, Odette. Get her assessment of his condition. Again, I would plead with you if his actions are truly driven... If you are wounded, you may take a bed in the corner. I'm sorry to say that Sir Hughes is in no condition to talk. I tried to help him, but this is simply beyond my ability to... I do not think you could cause his condition to be any worse, so you are welcome to do what you like. marriage was a mistake. He's put us all at risk. Uh. Lacana has everyone fooled. 
She and her father are plotting against us. Duchess Rakama is orchestrating an attack on Halkair. She must be stopped. The Duchess has betrayed us. What are you Grace. doing here? I have to stop. Leave her. my room at once. Whatever it takes. I won't allow Halkair to fall into Red Guard hands. Halkair in Red Guard hands? <laughs> Tears are set. You've gone mad. I'm sorry. But this is the only way. No, please! What have I done? I killed her. She deserved it, didn't she? No. It's a never-ending nightmare, whether I sleep or not. I killed Duchess Lakana, an omen of fear, always with me, always whispering. Telling me about the Red Guards, about Lakana. Ivan, we have to kill it. You have to kill it. My sword in the dream. I need to repair my stuff. You killed the omen. Maybe. Yes, I'm all right. But not absolved. I ordered the night. Sir Edmund sent for me, and I came as soon as I could. Sir Hughes does not plead for clemency, yet he says his mind was not his own. As strong as my anger may be, I sense truth in your words, and some change. He asked me to take his life and restore honor to the Knights of the Plain, but my emotions are... Very well. Thank you for your counsel. Rise, old friend. You will not die this day. Then my punishment is living in disgrace. Cannot allow one who committed so grievous... Sir Hughes may live, but he will never stand in my court again. I hereby strip him of his knighthood. I exile him from Alcair. He may never return. Though the immediate danger is past, I fear this might be more than an isolated event. Sir Hughes driven mad by nightmares. The spirit wardens of Pariah Abbey. They dabble in Daedric rituals, but they're oh. benevolent. Speak to Brother Moron at the Abbey. Ask him if the appearance of this omen should be cause for wider concerns.
hier. Sass. I don't understand how this could be happening. We have no feud with the Mid- Certainly! The bandits set everything on fire. The whole place is going up in smoke, and they're preventing us from putting the fires out! Take this bucket. If you can get- I appreciate your assistance. Smugglers mostly. And gamblers. Even petty thieves. But they- Wounded to tend to, but I'm wounded myself. Take these poultices. May Azura bless you for all your days. You will always be welcome at the Abbey. May Azura bless you for all your days.
You will always be welcome at the Abbey. I can see the many of the thanks for pitching. I hesitate at both. But I saw many of my thank you for that. Say, I heard you recently arrived from Alcare. There are terrible rumors about Duchess Lacana. Are they true? Was she murdered? I am sorry to hear about the Duchess. She was a good woman. The omen of fear, you say. Side of before. Friend or foe, declare yourself. No one will harm. And I have more terrible news. Those damned outlaws cast a sleeping spell on Abbot Jurok. I can't wake him. As Jura prays his foresight, this will get us back to the Abbey. Jurok said this scroll of summoning should be read near the largest fire in the field. Please take it and use it there. An Atronach. Simply amazing. Jurok, you were right, my friend. You were right. He's still under a sleep spell. But I've learned something. The Midnight Union wanted us to panic, the attack, the fires. You must awaken Abbot Jurok. He'll know how to get the dream. We can't create one. The Dream Shard is a priceless relic. A mm -hmm. literal piece of Azura's realm of moon shadow. With it? We can distill water from the Cave of Dreams into dreamless potions. Without that shard, we, we use them to protect ourselves from nightmare attacks by our enemies, the Supernal Dreamers. Since we don't dream, we're not vulnerable to dream magic. 
We also send them to the king and his counselors. Another reason we're... Exactly. So you see how... A... Oh, good. Uh... You're the one who helped save our fields. It won't be easy. The spell. We drink greenless potions nightly. We have another. Po I'll be visit town very soon. have betrayed us the midnight union i can't my child these chains bind me to my nightmare however in this dream state only new words add it the key good once I've removed these chains we'll await you without you I'd still be trapped in that you saw my dream clearly the Amina's cult the supernal dreamers is behind this betrayal by the Midnight Union. The outlaw... I don't look forward to informing the king about this, but we must let... King Emmerich must be informed that without the Dream Shard, we won't be able to supply him the Dreamless Potion. Seek out the king in Wayrest and give him the news. Mine was a nightmare of betrayal, and they... It's an open secret.
The trick to spirit. I think I would work this table in that building, apparently not. My father, Noah Gior. See this a while. If you're in the mar Certainly.
like some gold, Walker? What is it? Welcome to the Bank of Wayne. A lot easier to not spend money if it's not in your wallet. It's a shame you don't get interest in money in this game. On money, sorry. Funny because that's a little castle in itself. from Pariah Abbey, haven't you? Don't worry about giving me the bad news. I'm already expect. Really? I heard rumors of chaos at the Abbey, but I had hoped they weren't true. Well, we need to go straight to the source. The Midnight Union does nothing without the approval of Count Hosni at Tura. I can't imagine him being behind this, but one never knows. Strangely enough, the man has apparently chosen this same time to have a betrothal celebration, and I happen to have an invitation. Fine. Probably get some fancy clothes. Just taking a break from work.
That is definitely not worth it, though. <laughs> God. I feel like the one in Windhelm is really good bang for your buck. If you could start, like you could report other players to the guards when they murder someone. They took him. They took everyone. Expect to get the lead. Doesn't even match the picture. Do you guys know there's a werewolf? Oh, sugar. That's unexpected. Till you've spoken with me. Count Hosny is in residence. Let me see. Ah, this is a platinum level invite. The Count says you get to come and go as you please. That's more leeway than he usually gives us. I don't mean anything by it. It's just, the Count is different. He's in the manor with his... Well, an 
unfamiliar face. I'm certain that... Is that so? Hmm. We'll see. Now, let's see. I gather you want a piece of the Midnight Union's action. As for me, I have a family situation. I want you to get the family signet ring. My father refuses to hand it over in protest at my involvement with Edema. That ring sh I've put him for safekeeping in the guest house across the courtyard. See that you succeed. My beloved doesn't like failure and insists that I punish it. My betrothed is an unusual woman. She I know you. You're the meddler from Pariah Abbey. I don't care. And so we shall. I got a very bad feeling about this. <coughs> Did my son send you? Are you really? Did he tell you why he wants it? The signet proves ownership of our estate. Once he has the ring, my wife and I can be disposed of. So the story is true then. I hope you succeed, but not at the cost of our lives. Hosni only spares me because I've hidden the ring. If he keeps... Hosni has separated us. He's put Sorali in the summer house, above the beach. Go there. Make sure she's safe. Turn right outside my door, and go to the west. You'll just have to trust your in... Probably deal with these two. Keep out, you supernal brutes. Remember what happened the last time? Thank the Eight. I've been so worried since Hosni separated us. And now those supernal dreamers outside are threatening me. Though it could be... I do. 
and I think that so-called Lady Adema is to blame. I'm certain she's why he's threatening Rihard and me, and I'd wish... He did that? Then he's taken High Rock's main defense against Vermina's cultists. Oh, Adema's behind it all right. If, oh, if Hosni stole the Dream Shard, he did it for Adema. And if so, he'll never give it to you. And you are here to recover the Dream Shard, aren't you? If you help me clear her... I need evidence that Adema is controlling Hosni. Proof that her Daedric influence brought the Super... There must be some form of communication between her and the Supernos. If you can find, say, letters from the cult to Adema, I could use them to clear Hosni's name when this is all over. I suggest... Follow the path down to their camp by the dock. It's mostly guesswork, but informed guesswork. I had an aunt who briefly joined the Supernal Dreamers, so I heard the rhetoric. Alchemy. She gives him potions that put him into dreaming sleep, then visits his dreams, seduces him. The worst of it is, he's been betrothed to a good woman, Sister Sophia. Follow the path down to their camp by the dock. Alright, I might hop off um, before 10 because I'm not feeling quite 100%. Like 10's in 50 minutes. I'll probably hop off in about 35 minutes. you're still alive mara's heart this is exactly what we need i've been thinking about the dream shard and what i know about the vermina cult adima has been giving my son potions if you can figure out which one puts him into dreaming sleep and take some yourself i there must be some he often plays in
you want me to play something for you, you'll just have to wait your turn. What? I don't know what you're talking about. Take a walk. I've seen Hosni worship at a shrine to Vermina, and then take a sleeping brew. So check the shrine. The rest is on you. You have entered my son's dream. Some of yes, but the dream is Hosni's. Somewhere in his dream, that which lives in him. Sister Sophia was never worthy of you. At one time, there was a spark between Sophia and I, but she doesn't hold a candle to me. There is another one. Is weak. A shard should be powerful. Do you seek death? You found it. Lady Edema, she was the omen of blood. <laughs> oh, my betrothed lies dead before me, but all I, could, I watched from a dream is a nightmarish reflection of myself committed mad crimes of blood. I killed so many, I threatened my own pain. I have to repair the damage I've done. The first thing I'll do is order my guards to drive the... You have more urgent work to do. The Dream Shard must be returned to Abadurak at Pariah Abbey.
thanks you as I had foreseen. It is you should have the honor of returning the dream shard to its place on Azura. Thank you, mortal. I had my doubts, but it seems the abbot's faith in you was well placed. I will watch you more closely from now on. You have triumphed. The threat of Hosnia tore us mid- Not yet, but you've brought us a great victory. There Returning the dream shard to its rightful place is no small victory. But their Mina attacks on several fronts. Yes, Menevia is secure, but their Mina's dark influence now seeps into the eastern region of Gavadan. Azura's shrine there has been desecrated. It's the Supernal Dreamers again. I'm glad you're in this with me. We must stop the Dreamers, and if there is another omen, we must destroy it. I leave now for Shinji's scarf in Gavadan. I want you there too, but first. Hey, just chill out, dude. Chill out, lady. I was deeply saddened to hear of my sister's death. In Alakir, her murderer would have been put to the sword immediately. I wonder, though, if the custom here is more civilized. Mm. My sister was always headstrong. She chose Duke Nathaniel, and she wouldn't take no for an answer. They were on a state visit when we met the king and the duke. My wedding was first, followed shortly by... My husband and I must travel to Alakir to speak to King Paharajat, my father. We will return my sister to... Welcome back to Wayrest. It's good to see you again. Do you have any news? To be honest, this whole matter with the Dream Shard has robbed me of a few nights sleep. I'll be a royal grump if we can't get this matter resolved soon. Well, there we go then. That wasn't quite so bad as Abbot Durak made it sound. I'm sure he had his reasons, though. What about the Daedra, the omen that was by In Gavadan? Why couldn't it be in Morrowind or somewhere else across the continent? Gods! We already have enough trouble in Garvedon. General Gardron said he's the best damn general in the Daggerfall Covenant, if you ask me, and he's a good friend. His army... Well, that's good, at least. You two are the experts, though I suppose that's a dubious honor. If there is an omen in Garvedon, I'm guessing it's similarly disguised? Yes. Ernel was fighting with Gardron, but he's just been reassigned to shore up our defenses here in Wayrest. It may be a wild guar chase, but it's worth asking Ernel if he saw... recognize you from the stories. You're the one who helped save Count Atura, aren't you? He's an old friend. Well, you know as well as anyone else, these supernal dreamers have been trying to recruit people all over Stormhaven. We're hoping this will serve as a deterrent. If we catch a cultist, we'll... Really? I heard there was a woman who joined the cult in Alcair and tried to murder her husband. We don't... Sure enough. I was acting liaison to General Godron out at Shinji's scarf. 
But he's worried. Between you and me? Oh, not that I know of. General Godron's been losing sleep, worried about the ogres, but other than that, everyone... It's not my place to question the general. Night, I'm a little busy. Explain once more why running was the best idea. Don't question my orders. Just tell the commander we need more soldiers. It's good you're here. The general says the battle does not go as well as he hoped. I told him you could help. I've had little time to search for the omen. Did you learn anything in Wayrest? Anything about nightmares and goblins? The general? If the omen were to get a hold of him, that would be very bad. We need everyone in can. You're just in time. I need every able-bodied man and woman. You're carrying a weapon, so I assume. It does, and by Moloch we need you. The Iron Hand ogres have stopped us cold out there, and I can't afford to lose any more soldiers. Will you join my clan? We've been trying to break through the ogre lines for days. Sergeant Olfen is leading the charge. If you can help him take the tower up on the rocks, we can establish a forward command post. Then we're in striking distance to finish this thing. I brought my army, the Iron Hand, both. I fought it because it was Bretons who destroyed Orsinian, and now Murtaugh clan must come to their rescue? Our chief didn't. Some of us do. trained to fight General, ogres, not rocks! To move out. Did he? Yeah, no. You can't so fly, can you? I'm sure it would make it easier. Failing that, if you're willing to make a run for it, I'll cheer you on. From back. If you can make the ridge, I'd bet 50 gold those ogres fall back. Take my wall.
Sergeant Olfen's impressed. Says you've got guts and you're fast on your feet. Assuming you can... Ha! Huh, there won't be an attack. I don't have the soldiers to spare. Abbot Durok says you're a champion. The ogre's leader is called Skull Crusher. He's big. It's a fight that's long overdue. But it's Clan Murtaugh's fight, not yours. The Iron Hands have been... No one. Just dumb. A 
All right. did it. I couldn't believe it when I heard the crash, but you... I searched through the rubble, was just about to give up. After what you did, it was an honor. You shut them down. Our soldiers cleared out the stragglers. No more iron hands. I know General... So you survived. I worried you were buried along with the oak. I... I don't know. When he heard the cabin collapse, he declared mission accomplished for the Iron Hand Ogres. I don't understand what happened to the General, but I will say he just... They're just upstairs. I know Abbot Duma. Yep. Bet the Lion Guard could use a... No Praise Azura. I was losing faith. You were right about General Godron. The omen of betrayal has the General in its grips. He was going to betray Emmerich. It sounds like her omen has been twisting the General's mind, convincing him to betray King Emmerich. No. Vermina and her minions still have the General in their grips. Don't question my orders. Just tell the commander we need more soldiers and more supplies. Yes, General. If you say we need them, then we need them.
deploy so many against the Iron Hand ogres? Why do you ask for three regiments? Vengeance. Emmerich, trust me. I can make Wayrus suffer as Orsinium did. allies, but don't forget who's in charge. Of course, General. After we sack Wayrest and kill the king, you can have the city. We just want the people. to cross me, Lord. I wish your presence in Quagmire. Come to me. You mortals, always such high aspirations. Do you really think my manipulations would be so vulnerable? You are not even... You can. There's nothing you can do now. The omens were a distraction, a daydream. Now the way. Once again, you return safely. King Emmerich? That... That is bad. We just received... King Emmerich falling ill cannot be a coincidence. Their Mina is raising the stakes, making a... You must go to Azura's shrine to cleanse the shrine. You need to get glow dust from the wisps on the eastern shore. That and the rare mineral azurite from the northern hills. I am gonna leave it there for tonight. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, please like and subscribe. If you're watching on Twitch, please consider following. Um, if you're watching YouTube and you want to check out the Twitch stream live, link will be in the description below. I might not be on tomorrow because I'm feeling a bit off today and I'm worried I'm getting a cold. Um, but there's a chance I'll be on tomorrow. If not, you might see me Monday. But yeah, till next time, see you later, bye.